So here we are for a new cooking with the babies uh, day. And uh, so today I'm going to show you how I make my so simple but so delicious uh, tofu gratin. So I hope uh, you like tofu because uh, it's uh, very good for the health. It can also replace meat, as you know, and uh, we use it a lot in Japan. So um, when I arrived here about 20 years ago, a friend of mine, hi Stan, showed me how to make it and you will see it is really so easy. So the, my little helpers are going back on the sofa. Voila. So I started um, preparing just one ingredient. It's very simple. All you need is tofu that I uh, drained. I'm going to, to press it again later on, but this is um, yaki tofu. It's um, grilled tofu. Voila. Then all you need, you only need four ingredients, the tofu. It's a, yes, it's firm tofu. It's momen tofu grilled. I don't know how you say that. I think it's grilled tofu maybe. Then again, <laughs> it is extremely simple. You will use um, ingredients, ready sauces, uh, because I find that those two brands works uh, the best. I tried to make the same tofu replacing this white sauce uh, made by Heinz. I tried with my own um, bechamel sauce, which is a little bit more, um, how to say, it's more buttery and it didn't work well. So I. I am sticking to my friend's recipe because it's really, it makes a well-balanced um, dish. So the tofu, uh, Heinz white sauce. This is some uh, tomato puree. Where is that now, baby? Stop it! Uh, Bianco is, I don't know what's going on with Bianco. What's going on? Where is that? Voilà, bon. The, this little helper doesn't want to work, I think. The, donc, so the tomato puree. I like this Kagome uh, brand too, for those who are in Japan. And I think with one block of tofu, one to 1.5 blocks of tofu, it's really the perfect size. Voila. I think, yeah, that my cat, he was uh, probably having some th things with the cocoa and cheese shredded cheese so any cheese can work because it's a gratin so you can put the the cheese that you like those are pretty like plain cheese it's not the the taste is not that strong but i think that comté or um, gruyere could work too so what i'm going to do is take the Check out if there is no more water in that uh, tofu. What you need to do is really to press it hard. Let me see. You need to press it hard to take off, to take out all of the water that's in there, okay? Voila, should be okay. I think I have some. Uh chicken paper in here. I'm just going to put it on some paper to make sure I got all the water out of there. Voila. And then it gets a little bit flat and it's, it, it's a perfect size to go into my uh, oven dish, as you will see. Okay, so here, then what we do is put the sauces. Là, voilà. Attends, tu vas te couper ça. Quoi de quoi là? So this is the white sauce. Euh, 
Uh, I need this spoon. Where is my big spoon? Okay, I don't find my. I can't find my big spoon. Let's use this one. So I put the. What I do is that I put half of the white sauce at the bottom of the dish. Like this. <laughs> As always, it's just showing you what uh, the ingredients and how to mix them to make a dish. It's not real cooking. Voila. La, our little helper is here. C'est bien, Charlie, très bien. Voilà, you're a big help. Then, put the tofu. Né? On met le tofu, voilà, comme ça. Là, so it fills, it fills the dish. Né, petit chou. T'as bel eau. T'as bel eau. Don't spit it, hein. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that uh, Charlie liked tofu. Okay, then, then the puree, tomato puree. He ate to Charlie uh, ate the tofu. That's the first. Okay, so the puree. Again, I like this uh, Kagome brand for those. Or in Japan, it's not too strong the taste, I think so. Uh, no, sorry. So then I put the rest of the white sauce. Voila. It might not look so tasty when you see uh, the sauce all firm like this, you know, but it will melt, it will get, no baby boy, it will get. Uh, Oh, no, I can't yo. Dame da yo. It will, it will have a nice texture when it cooks in the oven. Dame de cho. Dame de cho. I know you're the star, but no, I can't yo. Attends, chou tomate kudasai. Hai, machi macho. Dame da yo. Voila. No, and he insists. <laughs> He's, uh, Charlie is very genki today, huh? <laughs> you, well, I think this is the proof that this dish is going to be super good. No, dame, dame desu. Yame nasai. Akan. Voila. We need to put a barrier in between you and this dish. Voila. And then, the puree. Dame da teba. Akan yo. Voila. Dame des. Je vais te taper. Je vais te mettre une fessée si tu continues. Hein? Voilà. So easy, né? Yo. Voilà. And then. Just some cheese. Eh? Tu bouges pas, bébé boy. Là. You know that I like cheese, so I will put a lot of cheese. Oh, yes, it's Jennifer feeding uh, Jennifer. Voilà, so lots of cheese that we will grill in the oven. Voila, I think this is another extremely simple dish. Là. So I always put, you know, the cheese really on the side, up to the side of the dish, because if not, it doesn't come out so nicely, I think so. Okay. And you can have... <laughs> I'm worried that Charlie would eat this when I'm not watching him. Voilà. You can add a hint of um, just a, a little bit of voila, some pepper 
because the color will be nicer. And also, you come with me. Voila. Um, when I make gratin, no, you go. I always put a little bit small pieces of butter on the cheese because <laughs> but I need a mic a mic so a microphone so you can talk to him, you tell him not to eat the cheese. I put two to three small bits of uh, butter on the cheese because then the cheese get gets really a nice golden uh, color, I think. Voila. But if you don't have, if you don't want to put any, I think it's okay. But this is how I like to, to make my gratin. Voila. C'est bien. Attends, no, I can't concentrate. Charlie is too active today. Voila. So yes, this is a French butter. This is a Echire butter that I brought back from France because it's... Uh, here, the same butter would cost uh, 10 times the price it is in France. So I try to bring back um, butter from France because I think it's tastier. And uh, this one is a, is a good brand. I think in France it costs something like uh, 2 to $3. Here it's at least $20. So you understand why I bring some back. And voila. So, so I'm going to put the dish in the oven to bake it, to cook it. And what I, I will do is show you another dish. So that was the tofu gratin with, um, once, once again, the ingredients, one uh, pack of uh, grilled tofu, a yaki tofu. And then the Kagome's tomato puree or another tomato puree if you have one that you like. And I like to use the white sauce from Heinz. So I put a layer of white uh, sauce, then tofu, then another, the rest of the white sauce and then um, the pu tomato puree and shredded cheese. A little bit of, uh, <laughs> of uh, pepper and um, small pieces of butter so that it gets grilled nicely and it get, it gets that golden color. I'm going to put this in the oven and then I'm going to show you another you're going to your tongue kawaii so you um, I'm going to show you another dish maybe hopefully this will get ready in the meantime so you can see the result i've been thinking today so you can see the dish when it's ready so hold on a second i'm coming back charlie is going to keep you company <laughs> charlie boy tu travailles un petit peu mon coeur voilà please work baby voilà alors um... Okay, just going to take those dishes out of the way. Voila! Bon! Okay, so I'm back. Now, allez, Charlie Boy, shut up. Yamete kuda sayo. I'm, nobody's going to eat, the, I, I'm the only one who's going to eat this stuff, so I don't need to clean my hands, it's okay, even if I touch the babies. <laughs> I'm the only one eating, so it's okay, you know. I've got all of their uh, bacteria on me already, so no problem. Voila, yeah, he, that's his uh, B outfit, it's a new outfit. Voila, so... The other dish I'm going to make today is um, it's a French dish. Can you hear me? Because the oven is a little bit noisy. Um, 
No, my oven, I'm going, yeah, it's a big oven that I have. Attends. Uh, I bought it when I arrived in Japan. It's really a big one. Voila. Like, uh, I think uh, this um, stuff, it cost me, at the time, that was 20 years ago, and I paid something like uh, $800 for it, which was quite expensive because I needed a, a real oven, because you know, French people, we use oven a lot to cook. And I especially like to make gratins, so I needed to buy a real oven. But I know it's rare, this size of oven in Japan, because uh, people, everybody's surprised, uh, surprised when people come to my place and see my oven. Voila, so back to cooking. I'm going to make a French, a very simple, um dish it's vegetables it's green peas because today i was supposed to go out but i'm not going to go out because yesterday i think i had a little bit too much of alcohol so i have to do with the ingredient the ingredients i have here and i thought okay what vegetables do i have and i have green peas uh, frozen green peas in my uh, freezer so, and I also have, um, I don't have carrots, so it's just going to be green peas, but I could also add carrots, but I have onion that I sliced already, and I have something super yummy, hold on a sec, that I started cutting earlier. Look at this. Some of you know my friend uh, Kiki in the Pyrenees because I, I made a video from his shop. And Kiki gave me this um, ham but because it's bits he cannot use. I'm going to show you because he gave me four. I brought back four and he said, you can use one and then you can um, freeze the others and use them later. So I'm going to show you how a whole um, part is. Hold on a sec. Voila. He, he um, air vacuumed those uh, ham bits. It's, you know, I think uh, the elbow part, so there is not much, he can't slice this and sell it, so. And I said, hey, I can cook with this. And I want to make a garbure. Gar garbure is a dish from the Pyrenees with the big white beans. But I haven't been able to find decent ones at the store yesterday, so I need to go to one of uh, it. For those who live in Japan, they have a nice um, big white beans at a Natural House. It's um, a chain store that sells um, organic products. So I need to go and get some big, nice. Uh, white beans there and then I will make garbure with this I will we will cook this together because this is a very warming up um, dish too that is really nice to have now nice to have now hold on a second I'm putting this back huh? voila so yeah this will be ready in eight minutes. I didn't think, because usually I put this, you can put the gratin in the oven at about uh, 180 degrees to 200 for 15 to 20 minutes, just, you know, to heat it and to grill the cheese. But I use the automatic um, mode to make gratin. This is why it's uh, so quick, I think. And so what I, I'm going to do is, I started uh, making small, um, to cut this because it was a little bit hard. I'm going to make little cubes. And this ham 
This is the black um, pork from the Pire Pyrenees, remember? The um, Noir de Bigorre, Bigorre area black. Because this uh, pork is a black pork that really resembles uh, the Iberico. And I am not. Yamenasai! I don't know what they have today. There is something in the air. Like Pupu is. I mean, he wants to go out, but he's not until that uh, snow melts. Tu arrêtes, baby boy. I can't because like the other day he came back it was horrible he was all black and uh, with lots of mud and i had to put him a little bit in the shower and we had a big fight so no going out okay back to cooking usually when we make the petit pois um the green beans so we put the onion onion en français, the onion. Then we can also add some carrots to the green beans, which I don't have today, so it will be the simplest, the simpler version. And we put some bacon, but I think that this is going to be so good to replace the bacon because Kiki, he said that I could. Um, cook it in some olive oil that it would be so tasty so we are going to do that today voila this is going the upper to be the upper version of uh, the petit pois voila so let's cut some uh, of this ham voila so i'm just going to take you know the noir de bigorre you can eat the fat because this is uh, good fat Attends, can I zoom? Oui, un petit peu. On peut zoomer un peu, voilà. Um, this is good fat, but that's a lot, I think. So I'm just going to cut some of it. And then this bit, you know, it, see, it still has some hair. It ha he, he didn't clean it because, uh, you know, very often he, he throws it away. So that's a pity, huh? So I'm going to take off this part Attends, fais voir. Ah, caillon. Ya mette coup d'assai, petit chat. Voilà. So I'm going to try and make some cubes. It's pretty hard, hein? Voilà, it smells oh la la. And I can't resist. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. This is so good. Oh my god. Voila. Nice chunks of ham from the Pyrenees. me feel kind uh, uh, of better I think I don't have that headache anymore so maybe I could open some wine you know okay mm. I think I'm going to make all the rest of this um green peas so I have some for tomorrow too. Voila. Mm, that should be enough. But I'm not going to. This is a little bit more tiny. That would be a waste to leave this. So. And it will give us some nice. Um, Fat, the fat will give a nice taste to, 
to the whole dish so okay let's use it voila okay so also voila ah only 20 percent of battery left so hopefully i can make this to the end so no more talking we go to the cooking space voila hope this thing doesn't fall okay some light my le creuset I'm going to cook this in Le Creuset, uh, in this uh, Le Creuset dish, voila. No. So I'm going to put some nice olive oil. Nice olive oil I bought in um, Italy when I was in Toscana. Mm -hmm, very nice. I'd say about um, one teaspoon, uh, no, 1.5 big spoon. Attends, okay, I, we need a better angle than that, can you see? But not too close because it might, you know, I don't want to put some grease on my... Um... Hi, May. I don't want to put any grease on my screen, so voila. So let's heat this. I want to try and grill it nicely, so I'm going to put the heat up a little bit. C'est vrai? That's good? Good enough? You can see this is a vintage Le Creuset. I dropped it once and BAM! Here it got uh, some, uh, got bad, but uh, I can still use it. Okay, I think it's uh, hot enough, so. No, no, I don't want to fry my phone, no. Okay, uh, up. I think that's, uh, yeah, well, in Europe we drink a lot of wine and other alcohols, but, uh, you know, in Japan, Japanese people, they drink a lot too, huh? don't think, uh, no, I never wear an apron because uh, I try not to put food on my clothes, so, that I uh, dropped it many years back, that's uh, Le Creuset Pot, which is supposed to be super strong, but I dropped it and BAM, but it still works, so I'm still using it. You know, unless unless you guys want to buy me a new one. <laughs> Hold on a second. Maybe I should put some light here. Better? Voila. Oh, oh, this is looking good. This smells amazing. And my grandpa is done. Look at this. Yummy, huh? I think I'm going to try one. Up. Looks good. Okay. Let me put this a little bit down. Voila. I need to add my onion. Good. 
day then. I thought more than a second. What we are going to do is. Alors. Yes, it's a vintage. Uh, too close. <laughs> it's a vintage spot, yeah. Voilà. Okay. Under. Realization. No, not realization. Come on, the uh, under, under cooking. Huh? Voilà. I put the fire a little bit down because I want to show you something that is ready. Okay, no zoom. Okay, ikimasho. On y va. On ouvre. Ja ja. Ja ja. Alors, Mr. Oven did a good job, I think. Yeah, we need uh, smell vision. I hear you. Uh, oops. Okay. Hold on a second. Voila, the gratin. So I have um, it's too too much zoom. I think in there. Allez, hold on a sec. Là. Petit chou de Kitayo! Ok, you need to check this out. Hein? I know, I know. Attention! Atsuyo! Akan! Atsuyo! Atsui desu. It's hot, baby. No, careful. I think he can feel it so hot. So, here is the. This is the gratin. Ok? Là. Voilà. And I need to, okay, I'm going to show you the gratin, uh, but we need to add our... Hold on a second. Voilà. Okay, we need to, we should add, uh, add our uh, green peas in there. Mm, it smells good. The onion definitely adds some nice um, taste to the whole thing, I think. Voila. This. Then my green peas. Always convenient to have uh, some uh, frozen vegetables in your uh, freezer, I think. Voila. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Alors, attends. I see some comments. Sorry for not answering. Allez. Attends. Well, lots of peace because, you know, I'm not going to keep some. Then I will have some for tomorrow. But look, if I mix it, I think it's a good balance. Huh? Maybe I could have put a little bit more of um, of onion, but it should should do okay. I think I'm not going to put too much uh, salt in there because the ham is uh, salty enough. I didn't try the ham cooked. Mm. Mm. This is uh, salty. No, I don't have uh, any carrots today, Shin, so I am doing it without the carrots. Voilà. Okay, this can cook on its own. Mm. This is really good, but very salty. So I will not put salt in there. Mm -hmm. Come back to me. Voilà. So, I'm going to show you the inside of the gratin. Hi. Someone is angry at mommy.
And the big spoon. Let's open this gratin. Well, my, uh, he, he's angry because I'm not leaving him out until the snow melts a little. So, are you ready? Attends, trying to zoom a little. No, maybe that's not necessary. Attends. Oh, shoot. Voilà. Uh, okay. Let's break the cheese hat. <laughs> oh, I really need to open a, a bottle of Bordeaux red, I think. A time. Okay. Voilà. That's the inside. See the gra gratin. Voilà. It's. Uh, I, I'm not sure this looks uh, really good, but it is really good. Voilà. And that's a pity because I cannot take a picture. I can't take a picture to make, to make a nice thumbnail and then John is going to be like Jennifer you have to make nice thumbnails okay I will gambalimas so just I, I know the taste so 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 well because I make this all the time when my friends come and everybody wants the recipe so this is why I thought I would put it online and I think that you can really easily find the ingredients so I'm just going to let, let's check out the beans and then okay come back we are going just to finish the green beans and then uh, we will be done I think for uh, today's uh, live stream this will be the end of it I think I don't hold on a second this thing has a will of its own huh? this uh, gimbal thing sometimes Okay, looking good, huh? Mm, okay, the green beans smell now. They have the, 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 I can smell the nice green beans flavors, so, aromas, so, this is good. I think this is almost done. Huh? Mm, nice. Let's put some, it's ready, so I'm going to put some in the dish to make it look nice. Mm -hmm. Okay. Am I going to resist and not open a bottle of wine? Haha. -ha. I mean, French food. You, when you eat French, you just so want to drink wine too, I think. What do you say? Are you taking pictures? I hope so. <laughs> voilà. Merci, thanks for the chipping. I can see that someone chipped in, but I missed who and I don't know how to open this uh, thing called super chat so I need someone to explain me what if I have to press a button or whatever because I don't know how to do this I'm going to show you the the dish now Hello. I will give you some later you can eat your food first huh Voila, today's dish. Very easy, so easy, but so yummy. And the tofu gratin. <laughs> okay, Trek, thank you for the super chat. 
I don't add, press the green button. There is no green button. Huh? This looks nice, huh? No, we don't need those. Uh, we don't need this. Maybe it will look, look nice. That's not a very good angle. Voila. Okay. No, Alors. Yeah, well, I tried. Attends, hold on a second. The uh, the gimbal. I'm really. I think I really had too much alcohol today. I'm. Mean, I'm not super uh, energetic nor efficient. But Charlie boy, you come here. Okay, let me see. So that was all for the cooking. Thanks for being with me. But if you don't mind, I will just keep put, try this. Yeah. Now, if I press the. Um, I have a kind of, it's like a flag with um, coming to NHK World TV. Yes, because we used to do the um, Tokyo Eye with John, right? Coming back to Super Chat, I can see a white flag with a um, star in there and I can see $5, but I... Uh, I don't know. I'm trying to press it and honestly nothing happens. Why? Please someone help me. Technology. Bye. Uh, okay. Well, it's not working. So I will just definitely need to ask someone or check out on the internet. And um, then, okay, you say uh, hello to John on Instagram for me. If he's live streaming, I'm going to enjoy my food. Thanks for joining and uh, we will see you soon. Bye bye. Bye bye.